A long time back, I made a video on how to remove an object from a video. After that, I got so many comments that people are not getting what I explained in that video. Maybe it was my fault and that I could not explain properly. But don't worry. In today's video, I have come up with two different variations where I will demonstrate how exactly you can remove an object from a video. In the first step, I'll remove a stationary object from a video, which is quite simple. And in the second case, I'll show you how exactly you can remove a moving object. And that's where mostly people are getting trouble to understand. So without making further delay, let's come up with how to remove an object from a video using none other than HitFilm Express. Alright, we are on HitFilm Express. So after making the composite shot, first you drag your video clip. As you can see, this is a nice calm landscape. And here I will remove the sun from here. Why? Because here my sun is completely stationary. So how to do this? First here I will make a duplicate of the same video. Now what I am going to do here exactly? Basically I will drag one neighbor portion and cover it over the sun. And in this way my sun will be completely removed. Why? Because there is no movement of the sun. So let's do it. Select your duplicate layer and apply one rectangular mask. And then go to the transform property and play with the position. Remember, you have to play the transform of the entire footage, not the mask. That's very important. So don't get confused. Now you simply shift your X position and place it over the sun. And you are done. If you observe some kind of sharp edges, you can play with some minor feather. And this is as simple as that to remove a stationary object from a video. Now coming to the second type and most demanded that how to remove a moving object from a video. But few things you should always consider. Footages should not be shaky. Background should be always stationary. Footages like crowd, dance people are not going to work. So as always drag your video clip on your composite shot. And obviously I will apply one circular mask over the subject and make it invert. Now since my subject is moving, so we have to animate our mask accordingly. So go to the position and activate the keyframes. Alright, so up to here everything is okay. You can see here there is a black portion. But let me tell you, this is not the black portion. This is actually the transparent. Meaning you can place anything behind this main footage. And by doing this, my moving subject will be removed. But what if I place the same video clip at the background and remove the mask and play with certain number of frames? Then your job will be done. So make sure you are in a bottom layer, mask should be always removed. And cut few frames and drag the remaining portion to the beginning. And see how my moving subject has gone. Nobody can say that there was a moving subject in this video clip. So you have seen both the cases and make a before and after comparison. And again, I would like to say, this trick is not going to work in every video clip. But yes, in some specific cases, you can use this. Drop me your comments and let me know. And I hope this time I made you clear. Smash the like button, leave your comments and share it. And don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. And I will see you in the next video.